So people have been asking for my controls, so here they are, prioritize neutral Versailles, that's a nice one. Um, all of these up here, these are just in the like form of arrow keys. I used arrow keys before, but the keyboard I have has special switches that are not on the arrow keys and are on these keys. Of course, pick up with light attack is off. That should always be off. That is terrible to have, so yeah. Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Wrenched. I just figured I'd really quickly record some Asuri gameplay because Believe it or not, that's who I'm going to be playing in low tier city. Thor, I, where is he? Not playing Thor. Basically, that's the point. You know, okay, sorry, it's time. Um, I want to start doing some more original videos than just kind of playing ranked. So this isn't going to become a common occurrence, probably. Um, the next video I want to do, I don't know. I'll do some kind of poll on the YouTube channel and we'll figure it out together. You and me and everyone else. So, yeah, that's about it. Alright, Ilyu. Ilyu's a god at this game, dude. He is the OG Lucian player of the entire world. That's why we have such a long history of ranked Three, two, games. One, but yeah, I'm kind of optimizing my Asuri. Also, I'm using base stance now. I, I was loving that last night with Santi, and there's a lot of stuff. Uh, that you can actually do that you don't normally have with uh, attack stats because you're missing the dex threshold for a couple things. And it makes guitars a little bit better in one situation, and it makes sword better in a lot of different situations. So that means I'm going to be also using the sword more. And hopefully I can show it off in a legitimate game. That's a true combo, by the way. That's optimal. That's part of this optimized Asuri. Let me show you one of these things here. Gotta hit a dash D right though. That's gonna be kind of difficult. Because I think he knows what I want. There we go. That's a true combo with the base sense Asuri. So yeah, basically her sword is insane when you go uh, to base stance. And I'm kind of hoping, like basically I fixed most of my issues with Brawlhalla in terms of like, lag. And um, you know, my game still gets frame drops every now and then, but not as much. So it feels a little bit more like I'm playing at LAN, which is home sweet home basically. Guitars are much better on LAN than they are online. So. Like, I feel like that's why I haven't done as well, partly. And also, like, why Axe and Hammer is so obnoxious is because, like, you know, online. It's not nearly as annoying to play against them with guitars when you're offline. Just because you have a little bit more of a barrier to fucking react to dodges, which, uh, you know, it's always useful. And also, it's not like, it, it's not online where it's like, it feels like they're always just skipping around. I feel like I've kind of fixed that issue. So it's kind of nice though. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty hyped for low tier, especially because like, I'm, I'm literally just going all in on this Asuri. Like, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm practicing more than ever, literally. That, that was a really nice game. But yeah, as you can see, 94 hours past two weeks, that's kind of crazy. For, for me, like, during the, during the actual school year that I was in, I only had, like, 40 hours max. That was, like, high for me at the time. Uh, or, like, you know, I had, like, 20 hours in the past two weeks at some point, I think. So it's nice to actually have this practice again. And, like, actually being, being optimal in how I play and, like, knowing what I'm doing again. <laughs> This dude is committed to Vector, okay, I, I don't know why, but I understand. That just contradicted itself, okay. Three, two, one, brawl. Whatever, I'm not here to talk, I'm here to play Brawl Hello. Watch, I'm gonna do it again. Oh, also, like, side light to end light is, you can hit it true, even in, like, orange with uh, the stance, if you hit it correctly. Which it's kind of hard to hit it in orange, but it's still possible. And anyway, it's tighter. That is that can be a true combo on base stance. That and their recovery.
that's just optimal. That you lose the one attack, so you just have to do that instead of killing with normal recovery. Which you kill even earlier than you normally would. Oops, I meant to do it. Okay. No. Please. Oh. But yeah, I don't know. I always feel like my guitars are better on a Surrey than any other legend, which is a bit weird. I don't know what it is about it. Maybe it's the Dex, maybe it's not. Like, Dex doesn't really do that much for guitars. Like, that's the thing, is like, you know, it doesn't do a whole lot for guitars, especially higher Dex. Um, so, you know, I don't know. Maybe it just feels a bit more fluid. Because I don't even really feel the, like, lower recovery on guitars, but I do on Sword Dare. I know that for a fact. This guy is just gone. That was a two minute game. That was really quick. Okay. Maybe I'll do a stream or a video someday. Ooh, okay. Nice. Ilyu again? I like this. Ilyu's really good. Like, he... He is very, very good at adapting during games. Except, Ranked doesn't really support that because it's best of one. And adapting in just one game is pretty hard. Like, it's possible and you definitely can do it. But it's much easier to do it over the course of some games. Oh, I missed those. Like, that's literally a broken combo. I don't know. It's really good. And this game feels so nice when you're not playing against heavy weapons, to be honest. I don't even really mind heavy weapons when I'm playing a Surrey, though. I just feel like my Surrey is good to the point where, I don't know, I'm just stable. Oh, okay, that was nice. Solid gameplay. It just feels right, you know? Everything just like works how a weapon like move should work. And they all work so well together on sword, dude. Every move just feels amazing on sword. No, I, I meant to chase dodge up there, I would have had that. Here's the Guitar's Guide offstage section going into full effect here. Alright. No. Oh god. I think you should use N-Sig more on this unit on it. End light Or out of end light Like it's- yeah, that's a really good sick. But yeah. Low tier city in like what, like 18 days now? I'm gonna be way ready for it. This video should be going up today is Tuesday, I think. So it should be going up on Wednesday. All right, solid. Pretty like, honestly optimal gameplay. That's what I like to see on the Asuri. As soon as I gotta grind this battle pass out, Okay, I'm gonna leave that in because that was kind of destruction of that bot before the improved bots come into the game. We're bodying the bad ones now. Three, two, one. I think Wubs is streaming right now. So this is like double the content, kinda.
Oh, also, apparently I've been playing on input lag. Um, because when I run two monitors, input lag happens. And I did that for Summer Champs 1v1. So that was a bit unfortunate. And I also have done it for videos in the past, not for this one. So if I seem like I'm playing better, that's why. Which is good, because I'm finally able to showcase good gameplay when I'm recording. So that's, I'm happy about that. Oof, I just barely reacted to that. Solid. I don't know how I got through that. Shouldn't have thrown. Works out though. Dude, sword just feels so nice! Oh my god. But yeah, um, let me talk about why I use base tents, especially for guitars there. Having end light to D light be one dodge window makes it really, really hard to escape. And the advantage state you get for guitars end light is very, very, like I talked about in the guitars guide, it's really easy to just wake up out of it. Hitting that D light makes it so your advantage state is much, much better because it's so much harder to wake up out of that. And because they've been hit by two moves, there's a much higher chance that they're gonna dodge there. Just because of like, you know, fucking, how, how that kind of works is like, you know, the they get hit by one, it's like, okay. They get hit by two, that's double the damage basically. It's like, oh, now I need to do something. So, you know, they either dodge or they just get full strung until they actually do dodge so basically my my explanation for as the advantage state is much much stronger you're in a much better position after doing end light d light than you are just normal end light so yeah i think this is going to be the last game here since i don't want this video to get too long you know but yeah i hope you guys are liking the the like consistent content now i've been really motivated to be doing youtube stuff i just need to get back on like twitch streaming and stuff like reliably and then you know solid Oh, that was good. He had no other options but that, basically. Okay. This might be the game that I lose, but we don't say that. That was actually close, okay. If he just went to the wall, I was not gonna get that. I didn't end my deal like that just because like I was falling off the stage basically. That could have been played a lot better. Oh my god, okay. Still winnable. Oh that's tough. Wait, why did he not just go back? This is the death of him. My game's frames are dropping. Whew, that was solid, okay. So I'll do, I don't know, I'll just do guitars. Solid full punish.
Let's go! Okay, no games lost this video. I'm pretty happy about that. I don't know if that's happened before or not, but that's pretty nice. Um, I almost got to 2700 just in this video, dude. I, yeah. So next video, I guess I'm going to get 2700 if I don't play ranked before then. So, you know, thank you for watching the video. I hope the gameplay was nice. I hope the commentary was nice. Press subscribe if you think it was nice. Um, yeah. Uh, comment about how I look like Mr. Beast or Jack Harlow in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So, peace out.